Welcome back to part 15 of my Tehenoin campaign in Immortal Empires. So in a previous episode, we have finally finished down here in the uh, southern Chaos Waste. The siege is gone. And we've landed ready to declare war on Teclas. But feeble-minded plans are of no concern to me. What the f... Eh? Wait a minute. Didn't... Eh? I'm sure... I'm a bit confused here. Um, well, I was going to show you. He was had a defensive allies with uh, the last defenders and... Tlac Okay. Um, well, anyways, that's definitely in our favour. Damage. I knew it was going to be that bad. I'd have fought that one. We will reclaim our treasures. It's a blood. Loot and occupy. Nice, right. Don't need uh, that one. Or oh, do we need any skin chiefs? Soul the Oh, I can get everything. Got an oracle. Let's take it. Okay, so you have an oracle. about that one. Right. Almost got uh, a few spells left. I suppose. What are we getting on? Carry on with Earth Blood. Ok, 
it. So that has got us a nice chunk of money. Can. Right, what do we want here? Capacity is always good. Have to get rid of that as well. Seriously, a Pyrrhic victory. Oh well. Oh, looks like we're going straight in on this one. Victory, Pyrrhic victory. Don't understand this game sometimes. Like, easy battles, it'll say, oh yeah, you'll lose. And then battles, when you look at it and you think, oh fucking hell, you know, I might not actually win that. It's like, yeah, you'll absolutely smash it in our resolve. <laughs> There's just no consistency at all. Okay, what is this? Yeah, that's pretty cool. I haven't really seen much of the uh, new settlements over in, uh, well, just lizard men settlements, should I say. Okay, so. There's only really that tower that can bother us. Terrifying sight that for the high elves. Just watching them stream forward. And they're opening the gates. I just, they opened the gate and he ran straight for him. That's pretty funny. 
That's the only time that bug has ever worked in my favour. Usually the bloody doors stay open, the gates stay open. You can't attack it, you can't get through. Come on, chase them down. Oh, get, up, get them before. Probably hit our own units here, but let's absolutely bombard them there. Hours. The unit Phoenix Guard, did he? Blocking the line of sight now. Let's get in on them. Oh, 
bad map. There's quite a few like decent sightlines and stuff if you had uh, gunpowder units and stuff like that. Silver Helms, right. Get the air contingent enough for them. Decisive victory, not Pyrrhic victory. I mean that one unit that we left for... Oh no, it wasn't even that unit I was going to say. The one that took a lot of damage. I thought that was one that we left for bait against the towers, but it isn't. The salamander's doing some nice work. Once they got in position and started firing the Phoenix Guard, that was the end of them. Ooh, gold. Nice. Okay, what do we want from here? Going for that. Um, yeah, I mean, we can get that. Gonna demolish that. Just don't use the lizard thing. Cavalry. To be fair, I haven't even tried the lizard main cavalry since Warhammer 2. Might have to try them at some point. Win three battles against Skaven. Okay. Where are Skaven at? Well, not where they actually say, like, how big are they doing? Clan Mars, mm, they might not hold on. Clan Rictus, they won't hold on. Clan Scryer, they're not doing too bad. Clan Nation will probably, yeah, it's a long way to go though. Well, a lot of them a long way to go apart from um, oh, Clan Mars. Well, I think they can't reach. Yeah, that's an interesting. Well, let's end the turn. Here he comes, Scar Veteran. I need a couple more of them, but we've almost got the building over here so we can recruit them anyways shortly. What do you want? Join what? Not yet. I will do shortly. Let me just deal with these. And then we'll decide who to go to war with. So last defenders, who's that? Nice. Oh, yes. The dwarfs. We'll have to see who is suffering the most over here. And we will assist them first. I mean, we'll probably be able to assist them both, to be fair, but... I cannot rewrite reality. Let's have a look. How are these doing? Minus 28. Let's have a look at them all. 36. 13. If we could get it to... If we could confederate it, it'd be so good. We we'll probably will do it at some point, but it's just um, 
a waiting game absurd. at the moment. Okay, we can reach. Right, so with you, let's get rid of them. Oh, one here and there, maybe? No, one here and there. Right. It's a gua, it's a new Can't make it that far. Oh, that's fine. Only a fool. You've got two settlements left. him. Do we need I can conjure What kind of army are you gonna be? I've got Saurus. Rounded his army up next. His army get a couple more temple guard. Replace you with Stegodon, maybe. 
Zaltzikliktakza! Yeah, something like that anyways. Right. I don't want to spend any more money in the Chaos Waste until all of our other settlements are pretty much done. I think we're getting there now. Okay, so let's go for that one. And Temple Guard. So if we go for that one, just in case we have to recruit up there. Now we can get that. Get that. That's a question. What would you ask of the Asa? Because you are still friendly. Um, I guess you just don't really care that I've gone to war with fellow high elf. That's where Scarbrand starts, isn't it? Death Guard, I'm sure it is. He's just gone on an expedition to take Scarbrand's capital and, like, left shit undefended back at home. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's just brilliant. Where have they gone with the army? Hopefully they're going up there. Right, I think Tehenna and Anoxia all could push up this side. I'm sure they, they'd be a decent team to move. Defensive line, no. Oh, here we go again. <laughs> Motherfuckers. I honestly thought it was mainly, um, It was mainly Zeech. I fucked you about that much, but. Gibar Jantul. No. Stop! You always go for your best ones, so. Right, what was I going to transfer to this army? Zadere. Zergusa. What was I going? To send. If we get rid of the Ark of Sortek, and bring in the Dread Saurian. Alright, then we've got. Yeah. Ancient Stegodon, normal Stegodon. And that's probably good enough. And then we're going to get our hero back, are we? What have you got? Have you got three ancient salamanders, though. Ah, oh, well, fuck it. Get out free. Well, if we bring you up, I'll leave us one slot. Kind of sad. Uh, Stegodon, maybe. Oh, yeah. Get another Stegodon. Alright. You old god!
Build that there. Demolish that. Far beneath an archmage. Even the lawmaster could not. We need to get some peroxy guards of that guy eventually. See what we can get. I mean, it shouldn't be much more now, to be fair. Right. Over here, public guard is an issue. Which we will work on. I'll put the missile over there. Okay. Going on up here. There's quite a bit going on. Oh, just check diplomacy for a moment. Why are you going down? Right. Well, that'll sort itself out. Minus nine. Thirty-six. Okay. So Teclis is all the way up there. Ludicrous. Right, well, let's end the turn. Need to get more sacrifices and all that. Sylvania is losing ground a bit. Oh, they've lost an army recently. A fool's errand. No. I put that in the wrong bloody army, didn't I? I was thinking then, I was like, why, why wasn't he uh, full? That's why. Alright, well, they're ready to start pushing. Keep pushing there. It's only good for trade, but I don't know how long we're going to have trade for. Yeah. I'm sure it'll pop up and tell me. Territory to these guys are only twenty two settlements. Okay, now nah, they're up here though, are they? Well. decision on where to go in the next episode so i hope you all have enjoyed this episode don't forget to like and subscribe because it will really help me out and i shall see you all in the next one